Welcome back pack, this is Adbio and the building is finally up. So we're about to do a full tour of this red iron metal building. Now, before we get started, don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. And then if you're looking for a metal building, we're your number one choice here in Texas. All right, so we do the, the metal building along with the concrete work. So that's what we're gonna check this out. We're gonna talk a lot about the specs, about this frame and the metal building. So. Let's get this going, guys. Guys, we're out here in Kingsbury, Texas. It's in the high 80s. It's kind of hot, but not too hot. And uh, you can see right now, we got the full frame up now. Uh, we do have some C channels we still got to put in, but overall, we already got all the Gurks, most of the Gurks, and we also got all this, the purlins up there. So this building is uh, 30 by 60 metal building. We did use a I beam for the main frame structures, eight inch I beam, and that is for your for your trusses as well as your studs. All your all the framing around the doors, uh, four by four posts, and then four inch C uh, channels running on the Gurks, and then also for your roof we got the uh, six inch C, C panels or C purlings. We also did the concrete work here. This is a full six inch slab. You should have seen in the previous video I talked about it. You can see here what we got is the notch, the notch work. And I'm gonna talk a little bit more about why it's, it's, uh, it's, it's important to have it. But here is where the roll up doors are gonna roll. And this prevents any water from seeping in. So we did it for every single door that we have. There's gonna be three roll-up doors. I need to remember which measurements they are. So I, I don't have my the order with me. But here you can see that the roll is gonna be there. We're gonna uh, chop this out, but the roll will, will land right here, so. Right now we're, we're rolling the uh, Insulation, we are using fiberglass R13. Now you do see here, we, it does have a reflective barrier, so this helps a lot in Texas to reflect the radiant energy, and this is to help control the thermal energy, the fiberglass. It is another option as well as spray foam. We do do spray foam. Man, this is just a beautiful building. It's actually 16 foot tall, so it's really big. With the white walls, it's just gonna look very like clear. Uh, and this is a 312 pitch. Let me show you guys something really cool. I like to look at these little details. So here's the notch work. And then here is uh, the panel that is overlapping. So what does this help with is like to prevent any critters from coming in. Um, and then obviously, well, the, the insulation is there. And so also any water from seeping in, cause you can see we got about an inch and a half uh, higher where the me metal building is. And the panels are uh, coming down that inch and a half. So any water is trying to seep in, this is how you prevent it. Look at how aligned these screws are. I'm gonna show you guys how we do it. You can see here, they're already pre-drilled holes. So all the panels, all the panels are laid out. And 
all the screws are already pre-drilled. That way, it all aligns. As long as the building uh, is, is square, is plumb, and uh, the seat channels are all aligned at the right measurement, there should be no reason why the screw will not bolt to one of the girts or even the uh, purlins up top. Overall, it's, it's gonna also have gutters, so stay tuned guys. This, this building should be done in the next three to four days. Depends if weather allows. We started about two days ago, so it's coming along. This project will take about a four to five day process. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, stay tuned for the final, because we're going to be coming out. We're going to be checking out the final, pre uh, the final process of all this. So hope you learned something new. Again, if you're looking for a metal building, we're your number one choice. So reach out to us. Um, all the information is in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to be showing you a lot of cool new projects coming up. Stay tuned.